Hello everyone, welcome back to the asynchronous programming in .NET. In this video, we will see when we should use task and async await in C Sharp. So let's understand like when we should go for the, for the task. So when we talk about the task.wait is a blocking call, means it blocks the thread until the task is complete and ignore all other operation while you are waiting for the task completion. By default, the task run on a thread from a thread pool. If you are willing to block user interaction or ignore the other operation, it's always we should go with the task. So in that kind of the scenario, we can go with the task. But when we talk about the async await, so this is also a asynchronous programming and it's basically a asynchronous call. It keep processing the main thread, which means not blocking the main thread and allow you to process the other operation in the queue that we have seen in a bit before. If you are willing to allow your uh, application to do some other operation until the main task completion, you can go with the async await. And like for an example, if any method is returning something and if you want to make that asynchronous call, then we have to use the task because through that task we return and then that particular task method what we can do using async and await we can make the asynchronous call through that so these are the difference between the task and async and await and as per our requirement we can go with the any so that's it for this video if you have any question and doubt please comment thank you